Time seemed to stand still as Charlotte, Alex, Sir Thomas, and Cat the dog all stood frozen, staring into the swirling vortex before them. The gentle breeze barely registered against their skin as they stared at the two black feathers that had been spat out only moments before. The feathers skittered across the grass before finally landing at their feet. Alex's jaw fell partially open, words escaping him for several moments before he finally spoke. What the hell just happened? Sir Thomas shifted, his furry paw moving to rest on the hilt of his sword. He looked from Charlotte to Alex before gazing back into the mystical device. It seems the blackbird sacrificed itself. It's regrettable, but it showed us what we're dealing with here. Well, at least in terms of danger. Alex's brow furrowed as he stared into the vortex like it might reach out and grab him. I'm not exactly sure what I'm feeling right now, but I think it actually warrants saying flabbergasted. Charlotte's saddened expression while staring at the two feathers caught in the taller grass changed to confusion as she looked at Alex. What are ghasts, and why exactly are they flabbered? Alex turned his head, his mouth opening and closing a few times, as he considered how to respond to that, before he finally shook his head. It's... never mind. I'll explain later. The large, fluffy, black Newfoundland plopped down in the grass with a whine, and Sir Thomas moved a few inches closer in a show of support. It seemed Cat was just as disturbed by what they'd witnessed. 